Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. I have something that I am super excited to share with you. Two healthy, little kind of trying to be healthy, twist on some awesome treats to bring with you to places like we're going to our friend's house for dinner tonight. <coughs> Jax. Hey. So first up, we have mini blueberry no-bake pies. These are going to be delicious. They have a graham cracker crust and then a blueberry filling. So good. I'm really excited for those. And then next up is we have something that I've heard so many people talking about. I've never tried them before. It'll be my first time, but chickpea brownies. So they're flourless. Just have chickpeas. Can, can, you, can you not eat that? My finger? Thank you. Hopefully these desserts turn out well. I'm doing two just in case one of them is a bust and doesn't work very well. I have another one to bring as a backup. So hopefully all of the guests like them at this dinner and let's get to cooking. Actually, let's get to baking. The first thing that we have to do is make the graham cracker crust. So first off we need two and three quarter cups of crushed <laughs> graham cracker. Um, I don't know how many, oh my God, oh. Sam. I don't know how many that's gonna be exactly, but I will let you know once we get started. And then we need a quarter cup plus two tablespoons of extra virgin coconut oil, melted and then one tablespoon of pure maple syrup. So let's get started. <laughs> That's not gonna fix anything. <laughs> Pinch of 
of salt. I'm gonna double check that I have everything and then put it into the food processor and blend it on up. These are ready to go. I just cut the parchment paper so that it wouldn't be like overflowing because then it might catch on fire or burn. So I trimmed the edges off. I'm gonna bake this at 350 for 25 to 28 minutes until it comes out clean if I stick a toothpick in it. Yeah. And at this point, my blueberry filling should be ready to go. So I'm gonna take the graham cracker crust out of the freezer and fill the cups with the blueberry filling. Both of these desserts were delicious. I would say that my favorite were definitely these mini no-bake blueberry pies. They didn't even seem like an, a healthy alternative. They were just delicious. The chickpea brownies, they were still very good, very flavorful and rich, but I feel like you could tell that they were an alternative to regular brownies. Either way, you should try them both. Let me know what you think. You can find both recipes in the description box below. Alrighty, that is it. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so you never miss a video again. Bye!